Told you about people being robbed after hailing a ride share like Uber and Lyft. As WMER 2 News' Brittany Verner reports tonight, police say they have arrested some of the people they believe to be responsible for these ambushes. Hailing a ride through a rideshare app is some people's only form of transportation, but recently criminals have been preying on those people and preying on the people driving the cars. Now we're sharing some tips on how to keep yourself safe. Rideshare apps like Uber and Lyft have been helping thousands of people all over the world have access to safe and affordable rides. Uber's always been like a really safe place for me. Nothing bad has ever really happened. But within the last few weeks in Baltimore City and County, Police say at least nine minors have been arrested after being accused of carjacking rideshare drivers and taking over their apps only to rob the customers who hailed them. Almost every one of those, those individuals were arrested before by us for the same for a carjacking. Um, and all of them are, are, ju are young men and women under the age of 18. So far, there were five different cases, two in Baltimore County and three cases in Baltimore City. Police say because of these patterns they've seen around these carjackings and robberies, they've created a special way they respond. Immediately, uh, an individual uh, officer uh, is to notify our, our dispatcher that this vehicle is involved. That is given out uh, citywide broadcast, so now everyone within the city is aware of these potential vehicles involved. What we have done is created an initiative amongst the east side and the west side through my deputy chiefs in reference to having uh, individual patrol officers form teams in reference to these problematic areas and in reference to this increase in carjackings and robberies. I would just say to be careful, make sure to check that it's the right car and the right person because Uber does have a picture of the driver. You have to be extra cautious. Make sure you share your location with somebody you trust. For more tips on carjacking and robbery prevention, visit our website at WMAR.com. Brittany Verner, WMAR 2 News. All right, tomorrow, Baltimore Police and the FBI are going to hold a news conference to give more details about the recent rideshare app, carjackings and robberies. It'll start at 2 o'clock and that'll be held right there at the police headquarters downtown. All right, coming up.